Good afternoon. This is going to serve as an instructional video for how to use Kahoot and some of the basics on how to even create a Kahoot for your classroom. To start, we're going to go to getkahoot.com. Now your students will go to just normal old kahoot.com, but as an educator, you will need to either sign in or you need to sign up for free. I have an existing account, so I'm going to go ahead and hit sign in. This is going to take you to the main screen. As you can see, you can create a quiz, a discussion, a survey. I already have my Kahoot main, so I'm going to go ahead into My Kahoots, and I'm going to go ahead and hit Edit so I can show you some of the basics on how to make a quiz. Now, this is the quiz I have made, and as you can see, it shows you the existing questions that I do have. Let's go ahead and hit Edit, and that takes you to the actual question. You can see that I have the question itself, the four answers, and you are able to pick a correct answer. You may add a picture or a video if you so choose, and you can credit your resources if you are using any. I'm going to go ahead and hit next because I am satisfied with this question, and it takes you right back to all the questions you have created. I'm finished with this at the moment, so I'm going to go ahead and hit exit. Now you can make as many questions as you want or as few. There is a limit to the words, and there are some restrictions, but as far as the overall quiz making process, it is very self-explanatory. After I hit exit, this takes me back to my main screen. I will once again hit my cahoots, and I'm going to click on the actual quiz this time, which is what you will want to do if you plan on playing your quiz. You may hit play automatically for your students, or in this case I'm going to hit my title because I would like to preview this quiz. Now this is almost like a demo mode. What you see here is what you will see on the screen and as an educator. What you see over here to the right will be what your students see on either their smartphone, tablet, laptop, or device of choice. Now before I start the quiz, I do want to say that all of this is from my lesson plan and classroom response assignment. And it is going to cover the mathematics number sense grade 3 SOL. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and hit classic, which is what the common option is and you can hit ready to join. Now as you see on the left hand side there is a pin number given. That pin number will be what your students have to enter to start the quiz. So I will go ahead and enter this pin now and hit enter. And I will put this as test one as my name. And you will see this pop up and all your students will pop up here and if you so choose not to like a name, you can edit it if it's not appropriate for the classroom. Go ahead and hit start, and it shows you question one. Now this is what you're seeing on the screen, and this is what your students are seeing here on the right. And they have 30 seconds in this case to answer. So I'm going to go ahead and hit my answer, and there you have it, one correct answer. Go ahead and hit next, and it just takes you through the quiz. Now we don't need to play all four questions, so I am going to exit out. And you can exit out at any time. I'm going to leave. And it's bringing me right back to my main menu. Thank you for watching this instructional video, and I hope this was helpful in your use of Kahoot.